Hey, my loves. Happy Wednesday. Um, I don't have a whole lot of new topics that I can think of to talk about with you guys. Um, I want you to give me your ideas, what you'd like to hear me talk about. But I figured since Christmas is right around the corner, I'd give you my pointers for affordable Christmas shopping. If you have the internet, it is going to be your best friend. And I'm not saying for ordering online, but before Black Friday, you can go to different sites. I'll list a couple below that tell you the Black Friday deals before the paper actually comes out. And some of these websites allow you to go ahead and make your shopping list so that day you're not walking around blind, basically. So you know, okay, I've got to go to this store, this store, and this store. Um, I found this year a lot of things I'd already put on layaway for Marshall's Christmas were on the Black Friday list for a lot cheaper, $10, $15 cheaper. And $10 and $15 adds up over the span of everything you buy your child for Christmas. Um, my little boy is a little too spoiled this Christmas. I went a little crazy. And I know he won't remember it, but I think it was more for my benefit because I just love Christmas. It is just, I love it. I love how happy Christmas feeling gives me. But anyway, that is my number one tip. Black Friday, you guys. Even if you're not out there at 2 and 4 a.m., you can still get good deals all day that day. I mean, really, until the things sell out. My number two thing, Walmart has brought their layaway back. Walmart is every mom's best friend unless you just are rich. If you got a lot of money, you know, it doesn't matter. But I do not. <laughs> layaway is a working mom's best friend as well. Kmart also has layaway. All Marshall's Christmas this year will come from Kmart and Walmart because they have layaway, which caters to moms like me that don't have a whole lot of money. So I think that is awesome. Another tip I would give eBay. Um, a lot of times you can find items that are going to be a little bit cheaper than what you would find in the store. Amazon.com is almost always about $5 cheaper than what you're going to find at a department store. And sometimes around Black Friday and the holidays, you can get free shipping on a lot of sites. If you can find a site with free shipping, it's going to be your best friend. Now, this next thing, I guess, is not controversial, but everybody will have their own opinion about it. To me, secondhand things, toy-wise, for a toddler is a great idea. They're not going to know they're secondhand. They're not going to care they're secondhand. You give your child a box and they'll be happy. So, thrift stores. And I would say, once upon a child, if you have one in your area, you should check it out. They go over everything before they buy it and sell it to you. They do not sell you crap. It's all normally in working order and in good condition. So your higher end thrift stores, they, I've sold to them before. They literally go through everything. They've even given me some of my stuff back that I thought was nice that they were like, no. So that is also going to be a really good option if you're trying to save money this Christmas. Um, even if you go out and buy super nice things and you want to add a few more things that are more affordable to your child's list, once upon a child, there you go, it's awesome. Um, Craigslist. For outside toys, if you're thinking about buying your child a swing, a playhouse, a sandbox, <coughs> those things are going to be outside and are going to get bleached out by the sun anyway, so why not go ahead, save a little bit of money, and get used. You can find some really nice things for second hand. A lot of people will use their things for one child, maybe a couple months, because we know how fast our children get bored with toys. And then put them on Craigslist. And I think that that is another awesome way to do it. I'm sure some of these things you've already thought of. I hope I've given, given you some ideas that you haven't considered. I hope it was helpful. It is what is getting me through my Christmas. Um, and when I get everything off the way and get all my things together for Marshall, I'll show you what I did. And I hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you next Wednesday. And let me know what you want to see. Love you all. Bye. Thank you.